Hello and welcome to How to Play Backgammon, presented by GatherTogetherGames.com. This video will cover the basics on how to play the game Backgammon. The video will start with the general concepts and gameplay, and then get into more of the details for the game. Backgammon is a two-player game with a player sitting on each side of the board. The board has four quadrants and each quadrant has six points. These points can be seen as the board's spaces, giving the board a total of 24 spaces. Each player has 15 checkers. Player 1 has the dark colored checkers and they are set up as follows. Player 2 has the light colored checkers and they are set up to mirror player 1's checkers. During gameplay, player 1's checkers will only be able to move counterclockwise and player 2's checkers will only be able to move clockwise. The object of the game is to be the first player to remove all his checkers off the board. Checkers can be removed only when all your checkers are within your home board. Each player's home board are the first six points in front of them shown here for player one and here for player two. The game begins with each player rolling one die. The player with the higher number rolled gets to use both dice for the first move. Player two rolled the higher four and gets to move first. The number rolled on each die equals the number of spaces the player can move a checker. Player 2 moves one checker two spaces for the two rolled and moves another checker four spaces for the four rolled. Play moves to player 1. Going forward, players roll their own two dice and move accordingly. Player 1 rolls a 4 and a 1. Player 1 moves one checker four spaces for the four rolled and moves the same checker one more space for the one rolled. Play moves back to player 2 to roll. Players continue to take turns rolling and moving checkers. A player is not allowed to move a checker to a space that is occupied by two or more of the opponent's checkers. Here, player one would not be able to move this checker six spaces for the six rolled since the landing space is blocked by player two's checkers. When a player lands on a space that is occupied by only one of the opponent's checkers, the opponent's checker is moved to the middle bar. Here, player one moves one space for the one rolled and lands on the single checker of player two. Player 2's checker is moved to the middle bar. When a player has a checker on the bar, the player must return it into gameplay before moving any other checker. A checker on the bar returns to the board starting with the farthest space for the player. Here, player 2 will return the bar to checker one space for the one rolled. Now that the checker has been returned to the board, player 2 can move any checker for the two rolled. If a player rolls the same number on both dice, it is known as rolling doubles. The player that rolled doubles gets to move a total of four times, twice for each die. Here, player 2 rolls double threes. A total of four moves of three spaces each are taken by player 2. When moving the same checker with both dice numbers, the intermediate point has to be open. For example, player 1 has rolled a 3 and a 4. Although 7 spaces away is open, this move cannot be made because both 3 spaces away and 4 spaces away are blocked. Going back to the gameplay, both players have moved all their checkers to their home board. Once you have all your checkers in your home board, you can begin taking checkers off the board with each roll. Player 2 rolls and moves a checker 6 spaces for the 6 rolled to get a checker off the board. Player 2 then moves a checker 3 spaces for the 3 rolled. Player 1 goes next and can move 1 checker off the board with the 2 rolled and moves 1 checker 1 space for the 1 rolled. Players continue to take turns rolling and moving. The first player with all their checkers off the board wins. A checker on the bar must be returned into play before other moves can be made. If the checker is blocked from being returned into play, the player's turn is over with no moves being made. If a higher number is rolled than you have while bearing off, the farthest checker can be removed. That wraps up How to Play Backgammon. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and get more game tutorials by subscribing to our channel, Gather Together Games. Thanks for watching.